This short video shows you how to insert your license key and activate your Pilot Aware device. Firstly, you need to connect your computer, iPad, or mobile device to your Pilot Aware unit. The connection is done using Wi Fi between the two systems. Apply power to your Pilot Aware device and leave it for about 30 seconds to power up. When ready, it will transmit a Wi Fi signal with a unique name, just like your home router. This is called an SSID. This name will start with Pilot Aware B827EB and this will be followed by another six unique characters. Select this from the available Wi Fi signal shown and allow some time for the two devices to connect together. This will be confirmed on your computer iPad or mobile device. Note you may be given a message or sign saying that you are not connected to the internet. Please ignore this as you do not need to be connected to the internet for this to work. Now open a browser such as Safari or Chrome and type in 192.168.1.1 or type in paw.local. If this doesn't connect you to the Pilot Aware unit, just check you haven't connected to your home Wi-Fi router by mistake. You'll be now connected to the Pilot Aware device and with the latest 2022 software you'll be taken to the radar page. Earlier versions of Pilot Aware software will land you on the home page. Once you've landed on the radar page or the home page, you will see the words license expired. This is normal until you have inserted your license key. Now navigate your way to the configuration page by either using the banner at the top of the page or the drop down menu. Once you have landed on the configuration page, type your 16 digit license key beginning with 5D9F into the four boxes provided halfway down the matrix. Please note that the license key is made up of 16 hexadecimal characters, that is 0 to 9 and A to F. Please note, a very common mistake is to insert O, Oscar, instead of 0, or B, Bravo, instead of 8, and vice versa. So please ensure you have installed the correct characters, otherwise the license key will not be activated. When you are sure that you've installed the correct license key, click save. And also click the refresh icon in the address bar. Once the correct details have been inserted and saved, the Rosetta will unlock and your license expiry date will be shown on the home and the configuration pages. For more licensing information, please see the licensing section of the knowledge base. Now move to the next section, Quick Configuration of Pilot Aware, to get you going. 